rocket sciences just released the papers all over the wire services where they believe that in 2012 there could be, well, the sun could have a temper tantrum. Mm. There could be a tsunami from outer space that multiplies Katrina by a factor of a few thousand. And uh, the property damage, according to this report, it's going to go to Congress. The damage could be up to a trillion dollars per year. A trillion dollars per year. Sounds like Obama's tax plan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but I, but I kid. <laughs> okay. But some saying that's the end of the world, 2012. Uh, well, 2012 is where the next sunspot cycle peaks. Uh, oh. The sunspot cycle cycles every 11 years. Uh, the sun actually flips in its pole. North pole becomes south pole. South pole becomes north pole. And it creates a burst of radiation, which then hits the Earth and could literally wipe out our satellites wipe out power stations, uh, food will rot because there's no refrigerators, communications will go down, mm. your bank account, your credit card, all that information lost because computers will be fried. Uh, trillions of dollars in property damage per year will take years to recover from something like that. And all the and compasses that would just be uh, obsolete. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and all the iPods and uh, you know anything anything electronic. So uh, not the end of the world, just a real pain in the ass. A huge <laughs> one. Inconvenience. <laughs> no, we're talking about food riots. Uh, yeah. We're talking about starvation. That's we're talking about uh, mass mass unrest when people are literally starving in their apartment houses without any access to electrical appliances, credit cards wiped out, bank accounts wiped out. With all that said, let's not forget Y2K was a bust. So, uh, Yeah, remember, uh, we don't know if 2012 is going to be another a peak in, this, in the solar cycle. All we do know is that it will be peaking in 2012. And in 1859, when we just had telegraph wires, there was a huge, gigantic tsunami that was documented. It wiped out a lot of telegraph transmissions in the United States. If that thing had hit the Earth, it would have paralyzed our satellites. It would have pa paralyzed our power supplies. It would have caused mass rioting throughout not just one country, but the entire world. Anything wow. that depends on electricity. And back then, they just, yeah, the telegraph went out. Yeah, they back then, why. they didn't know, and they didn't care. You thought know? it was the engines, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're buying guns today.